The key to understanding personality type lies in understanding the four mental functions sensing, intuition, thinking, and feeling S, N, T, and F. We have two perceiving functions sensing and intuition, and two judging functions thinking and feeling. Each of the four functions can be expressed in either the introverted attitude or the extroverted attitude. That is to say, they can either be kept in our inner world or presented to the external world. There is an order in which we use these four functions. We have a dominant function, which is our favorite function. We put the most energy into this function and we have the most confidence in it. It is part of our conscious frame of mind. We have an auxiliary function, which is our second favorite function. This balances our dominant function and is also part of our conscious frame. We have a tertiary function, which is our third favorite function. The tertiary function is always opposite to the auxiliary function and is not found in our four-letter code. It is mostly part of the unconscious. Finally, we have an inferior function, our least favorite function, which is not part of our four-letter code either. This is the opposite function to the dominant and the most unconscious function. This function can be triggered in a negative way by stress. When looking at the triggers for stress, we will be looking at the inferior function and how it affects our personality and our behaviors. We will also be looking at the behaviors and activities that feed our dominant function and what we need to bring us back into balance and equilibrium. Let's take an ESTJ type as an example. An ESTJ's dominant function is thinking. His or her thinking is in the extroverted attitude, that is, it is presented to the outside world. An ESTJ's auxiliary is sensing. This is presented in the introverted attitude, that is, it is kept in the internal world. This type's tertiary function, hidden in the unconscious, is intuition, the opposite function of the auxiliary sensing. Now remember, the tertiary function is not found in a type's four-letter code. Finally, the ESTJ's inferior function, also hidden in the unconscious, is feeling, presented in the introverted attitude. So, an ESTJ is better understood as a dominant extroverted thinker with auxiliary introverted sensing, tertiary intuition, and inferior introverted feeling. In this program on wellness and stress, however, we will only be focusing on the dominant and inferior functions. You'll find more examples of the different types in this document.